Joanne Cervella, and this is my husband, Bob Cervella, and we're recent owners of the Michael Cahill Bed and Breakfast. We purchased the property in May of this year. I grew up knowing this house. I was on the side street with my mother watching when they started to rehab this house. This house was boarded up and was overgrown with vines. The porches were gone. So 40 years later, I, you know, I always knew of the house. I came around the corner and there was a for sale sign. And I was always in love with this house and so called the number and came to see the house. I just made an offer on the bed and breakfast and after a pause, he said, oh, that's great. You know, I'd be happy to cook. So that's how it came about. Meeting the different folks, whether they're in town for a class reunion or a marriage or just to see old family members or whatever, to sit down and talk to them, it's been a lot of, very enjoyable. And we've always entertained. We always are, we're the house that hosts all of the parties, the holidays, and so it just was natural for us. It, it's, no. it's been a lot of fun. Yeah, no, it, it, it has been. Yeah, no regrets at all. Probably um, our location is really key for us. We're in the historic district. You can walk down and see the river. You can watch the lift bridge. There's a lot of history. There are history tours down on Bridge Street. Biggest things is it's so easy. Right out the door is the historic area of the harbor. There's um, boutique shopping down there. There are so many restaurants. Everything is handmade in these restaurants. There's, there's not a chain down there. So that and the lift bridge is a huge draw. The lake, um, they love the kayaking that they have now, the Indian trails. We've had people come bring their bikes and, and ride the Greenway trails. Um, they could Google Ben Breakfast. We also um, keep a Facebook page. Uh, there's also a chamber, um, business chamber that we, we are, we're listed on that as well. Um, so several places like that. 